What's up everybody? Disney Plus is here and so is The Mandalorian. But let's be honest, it's a great show, but everybody's losing their mind over this little guy right here. Baby Yoda, Yodeline, child support that Yoda's a deadbeat because of. Anyway, it's unbelievably cute. It's like a Mogwai had a child with Yoda, and I don't know. Memes of this little guy are giving the cat argument meme a run for its money. And for the love of God, I hope that thing goes away. Anyway, so what are we going to do? We got a great new character that everybody loves. We got to make one, right? Let's get it all started today here on 9142 Props and Armory. Okay, so we got Baby Yoda. And I kind of feel bad calling him Baby Yoda because Yoda's been dead for five years before we even see this guy. And this guy was born before Yoda was dead, so don't forget. He's 50. Anyway, R2 is still in progress. I'll show you a little video clip real quick to let you know that he's still in progress. I just haven't had time to make videos. I've had commission projects like this. I got to make a giant chewy bandolier that's twice the size of normal. Unbelievably cool. So things have been busy, but let's get back to this guy. All right. Models of Baby Yoda are starting to filter on to things like Thingiverse and through certain designers' Patreons and all that stuff. But it's a great thing to have really talented friends who are amazing people as well. Sean Fields of Project 842 has just finished a model of Baby Yoda. It is full size. The body and arms and legs are articulated and the best part about the whole thing is that he is offering these files absolutely free of charge. Link will be down in the description on where to get those files. All right, up on the screen is a, a, a rendering of Sean's files for Baby Yoda. And as you can see, it is articulated. It has movement in the elbows and at the shoulders and at the legs and in the head. And he's designed it so that you can plug in glass eyes um, or glass domes or whatever behind um, and in for the eyes so that they will look just absolutely amazing. So how do you get these files? Links are down in the description. But here's the cool thing. Again, he's not charging for them. What he is offering to people is this. It's very simple. If you download the files... And you use the files. You print them for yourself. You make yourself a Baby Yoda. You make yourself ornaments. You, whatever you're going to do with Baby Yoda as far as making them for yourself or for your friends. All you need to do is not send him money for the files. He's not asking for money. What he's asking for is for you to make a donation to Kids in Need this holiday season. However you would like to do it. It might be donating toys to a toy drive. It might be using one of those giving trees that you find in shopping malls and other places. Just find a great way to help out kids in need this holiday season. And when you do so, take a picture of the toy you've donated. Take a picture of what you're doing, how you're helping out kids in need this holiday season. Put it up on social media and tag it with the hashtag ToyDrive842. 842 for Project 842, which is Sean's amazing collection of digital designs that he does. So that's where you get the files. Get them, download them, link down in the description for those, and be sure to see it through. Get Make that donation to Kids That Need This Holiday Season. Include that hashtag ToyDrive842 to help kids have a better time this season because this little guy is giving us all a little bit better time this season. All right, can't just talk about the start of it. He released the files last night. I started on it already. I got more printing over here. I got more printing over there. 
Um, and when we're done with the video, I'll have more printing up on that printer up top. All right, so let me show you. You ready? You ready? Because even in this state, it's still unbelievably cute. Okay. Okay. Oh, oh my God. Look at that. Look at that. Looks amazing. Looks fantastic. But to print off the beginning of it, I wanted to get something done quick, so I printed the head uh, with no supports. And it is a hollow model, and it came out perfectly without supports on my, my Creality CR10. I printed it in a nice new PLA Plus filament that I just got the other day. Ceramic 3D, got it on Amazon. PLA Plus, it was like 14 bucks a roll. Nice stuff. The ears I printed on the Anycubic Photon. I printed them in a clear resin. Now the hope is that I can do a very light paint finish on here. Light enough so that we can still have, and still will allow for light to pass through the ears because that is one of the coolest things that you see um, with this character is the way that it interacts with the light. So we want to be able to, to, to have that as well um, on our finished one. This is going to be a full-size body. Uh, we're going to print the rest of the body. I'm going to get that done uh, this week. And then next week, we'll get back together, put this guy together, uh, do some painting. We're going to make an outfit for him. And we're just going to put him out in the house somewhere or just keep him in the shop and then just enjoy the hell out of it. So files for this. Thanks again to Sean from Project 842. They are going to be down in the link down in the description for that. Get yourself the files. Do something good for kids. Be sure to use that hashtag, ToyDrive842, and have a hell of a lot of fun printing a baby Yoda of your very own. So for now, it's John. If you like the video, be sure to give it a like. Go ahead and subscribe to the channel as well. I do all kinds of other interesting builds like this on the channel on a fairly regular basis. Anyway, I gotta get back to work. I gotta box this thing up. It's going to Canada. I gotta work a little bit more on him. I got some other stuff to finish for people. So it's John. Have an awesome week. We'll see you again very soon.